Hey smileys, it's AI and this is AI Brown Smile and I'm back with another video. In today's video, I am going to try to make Mama Mai's turmeric face mask. I don't know if that's the official name for it, but that's the name I have given it. Mama Mai is Jeannie Mai's mom. Jeannie Mai is one of the hosts on the real daytime television show. And Jeannie Mai has a YouTube page on which she showed her skincare routine. And at the tail end of the video, her mom, Mama Mai, jumps in the video and it's like, okay, if you really want good skin, this is what you need to do. And then she gave a list of ingredients that are supposed to make this brilliant face mask that is gonna give you the most magnificent, glowy, best skin you've ever had in your life. So I was like, I definitely have to make that. She didn't share how much each ingredient to use. So I'm gonna be doing a little guesswork there, which is fine. I'm gonna give it my best try. Mama Mai, if you're watching this, I hope I do your face mask justice. So let's get right to it. First things first, here's a list of skin benefits, ingredients, and instructions for applying the mask. The ingredients include one tablespoon of turmeric, one tablespoon of coconut cream or coconut oil, one teaspoon of plain yogurt, one tablespoon of organic raw honey, and three to five drops of lemon essential oil. My recipe notes actually say a teaspoon of turmeric, but I tweaked the recipe a little bit. As I've mentioned in previous videos, raw honey is packed with skin benefits, especially if you have acne or other skin conditions such as eczema or psoriasis. However, only use manuka honey or another unpasteurized raw honey on your face. Coconut milk is rich in antioxidants and can delay visible signs of aging like fine lines and wrinkles. And yogurt is a source of anti-aging and skin softening alpha hydroxy acids. Finally, turmeric brings out the skin's natural glow. It's packed with antioxidants, helps to treat acne, and calms the skin. Combine all of the ingredients and mix them until blended well. You should get a nice paste-like consistency, like this. I also added about three drops of lemon essential oil, which is known for being astringent and detoxifying and helps with oily skin. It also clarifies and acts as a gentle exfoliant. You can even add a few drops to your facial cleanser to help remove dead skin cells. Okay, smileys, Mama Mai's turmeric face mask. Let's go. Here goes nothing. It smells really good. I'm getting some fragrance from the lemon and then also the turmeric has some fragrance and the sweetness from the honey, coconut, everything. The consistency is that of a paste, a thick paste, maybe like a mustard or ketchup. Masking is a lifestyle. You either love it or you don't. If you carefully curate the ingredients, there is a DIY face mask for every skin concern. They only take a few minutes to whip up and the ingredients are immediately visible. Sometimes. Now I am going to wear the mask for about 15 minutes, let the ingredients do their magic, and I'll be back. For the moment of truth, it's been 15 minutes. This is what the mask looks like. And I'm just going to rinse with some lukewarm water and apply my moisturizer. Easy breezy. Easy breezy. So whether it's to combat against oily skin or to deal with acne breakouts, there's a mask for that. I always use a hot towel after masking. It creates a steaming effect on the skin. Just wet a towel with hot water, then wring it out, but leave it a little bit damp. Leave it on your face until it's no longer hot, which is about two minutes. This also leaves the pores open and ready for toners, moisturizers, or your serums. My skin feels moisturized it doesn't feel tight or dry at all which is always a really good sign whenever you're using face mask or any kind of skincare anything that makes your skin feels dried out or really tight uh -uh, stay away from it but with this it feels really good i'm going to apply my moisturizer of course it's impossible to tell any drastic results after one use so i'll probably use this a few more times just to see what effect it actually has on my skin but first impressions i like I like. So 
if you try the mask, make sure you come back and leave me a comment on how it works out for you, how you like it. Um, and I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.